things you will need to perform this test is a multimeter configured for reading milliamps as you can see I've got the leads in the milliamp current measurement mode and I have set the multimeter into milliamps mode you will also need three clip leads with three different colors preferably You'll need to find your EHA valve and disconnect its connector. I connect one lead to the brown terminal first and match it to its pin it normally connects to. I then connect to the other pin of the socket and connect that to one lead of my multimeter. Finally, I connect the second pin of the EHA valve to the other connection on my multimeter. Now we are ready to read milliamps. With key on, engine off, you should in the vast majority of cars, see a reading of 20 milliamps. And of course, we do. Now things get a bit more complicated when it comes to the warm-up phase. You will need to seek out the service manual for your particular car because they are all different. When you are finished with your multimeter, do not ever leave the leads in the current measurement mode. Always remove them and return them to voltage measurement ports. Otherwise, you'll get a short circuit. 